Hi, this is Mike from Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To, and today I'm going to show you how to fix the white screen error on the Epic Launcher. This affects Fortnite and other Epic games. Keep watching to find out more. Okay, so if you've experienced the, uh, the white screen of death, as it's known, or just the uh, random glitchy screen on the Epic Launcher, then I'm going to show you how to fix it. Now this happens with the current Epic Launcher as of 2019 going into 2020. So let's go to the computer and we'll discuss it more and show you how to fix it. Okay, so on your desktop, if you try and open up the Epic Games Launcher. And let's wait for that to launch. And it looks like it's gonna do it. And you get this. So everything looks like it's gonna load and it works properly but you get all this graphical corruption and nothing works properly. The game engines itself and everything else works as intended, but the, the actual launcher screen doesn't. So what you need to do is close down the Epic launcher. So close down all that and to make sure that it's closed, right click on the icon and choose exit and exit again. And also you can do a control shift escape Let's bring up Task Manager, and you can also check that there's no Epic services running in there. So if you're happy that nothing's running there, what you need to do is to navigate to this folder, and I've saved a shortcut on my desktop to make it easy, and this is the string. So what you want is your local disk, then users, then your user profile, then app data, local, Epic Games Launcher, and saved. And then in the saved folder, there's a folder called web cache. And all you need to do is to delete that in its entirety. If for any reason you can't see this folder or you can't see the app data folder, make sure that in the view settings in Windows 10, you've got the file name extensions and hidden items shown. Otherwise, if you get rid of hidden items, you will not be able to find it very easily. So make sure you've got that enabled. So like I said, all we need to do is the web cache folder. So right click on it and choose delete. And that's the folder gone. So now we can go in and reopen Epic Launcher. Sometimes you need to restart the computer, but we'll, uh, we'll risk it and we'll try and reopen it and hopefully it should open properly this time. So give it a moment to prepare the files. Wait in. And there we go. So now our launcher is back up and running as it should be. Okay, so there you go, there is how to fix the uh, corrupted launcher or white screen error on the Epic launcher. If you've got any comments or questions, feel free to stick them in the comments section below. But in the meantime, I've been Mike, this is Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To, and hopefully we'll catch you in the very next video. Thanks for watching.